my name is Olivia. My name is Matthew. And we're going to be talking about photosynthesis and bidirectional hydrogenase and hydrogen production in cyanobacteria. With a quickly growing population and a dwindling source of fossil fuels, we need an alternative energy source. One of the potential alternatives to fossil fuels is hydrogen since it is the most energy packed substance and only yields water when combined with oxygen. Renewable biohydrogen production systems can be carbon neutral and less energy intensive. Photosynthetic species can use sunlight to produce molecular hydrogen in the most cost effective way. Our goal was to explore the photosynthetic potential of cyanobacteria as a source of energy for bioproduction of hydrogen. Cyanobacteria are gram-negative autotrophic prokaryotes. Many of these genera can be genetically manipulated and some are naturally transformable, which further facilitates their genetic engineering. In this experiment, we worked with Synecocystis PCC6803, which is pictured in the slide. The source of energy for cyanobacterial growth is sunlight, which is the least expensive source of energy. Solar energy is used to oxidize water into protons, electrons, and as well as oxygen. The bidirectional hydrogenase is a very complex protein. It has five different subunits, which form two large complexes. It is responsible for hydrogen production and acquires electrons from photosynthesis. We also know that the hydrogenase complex is inhibited when oxygen is present and will compete with nickel iron hydrogenase that favor hydrogen uptake. So in this experiment, we measured the amount of chlorophyll concentration per cell as well as the growth rate of photosynthetic activity. The growth curve measure in multiple liquid cultures indicated the consistent growth rate in photosynthetic activities. The data show a promising result in the consistency of photosynthetic activities. Since photosynthetic activity is a driving force for hydrogen production, it plays a key role in maximizing hydrogen production.